Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. So it's really sad for me. I feel very, very sad and that's why I am very happy to see, a, you know, a, a people like Jim, um, uh, Jim Chiseng, Honorable Jim Chiseng. I am Kashana Iwe Mwandi, congratulations. I'm clapping. I am clapping and I am calling upon young, uh, other citizens. Young people, you should take up the spirit of people like me, Jim Chiseng. Be courageous. Tell all these people to their faces. Tell them, you are already suffering, so what? Eh? You are already suffering. So just tell them off. Tell them off. Stop. It, it, it is, you know, she, she should motivate you. If you are scared to speak to these people, to these leaders, you should watch that video. Watch it. What she stood her ground by a church bachiaco at one patch to intimidate Kachwafeka Kuleka. She spoke and she challenged him. She challenged him. Eh? And I'm told, you know, at one parliament, I'm told when they were in parliament, they, they were uh, members of uh, you know, the opposition, they were running commentaries, except that, of course, we couldn't hear. Because they were not speaking through the mind. But there were so many running commentaries. Such that Raneri Muti, she must have been sweating in that gown of hers. She must have been sweating. Because today she had no powers to control the MPs. And there was no one to control them. But Raneri Muti could not control them. And there was no leader among the MPs to control them. This is when you have seen that it is important to allow a true leader to be the leader of opposition. Not umuntu from nowhere, Mwaisa Mumika Chiyoni were leader of opposition. There he was. You saw what you were you 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 saw what happened in parliament. That what Shwabu Bati if went to Ankwata, we have put years on the ground. You heard those continuous running commentaries. Where your president was embarrassed. He was embarrassed, he was told off by members of parliament in there. Running commentaries. Hmm? Do you think I mean? <laughs> but, but Anton, eh? I mean, <laughs> I, I, I can't understand. Some of these things, I mean, but Anton, you are which leader you? You are a whip for which for, for for who? Who can you whip? Eh? Who can you whip, Anthony? Who, who can you whip? Eh? Who whip what to a muse? Eh? Who whip what to a muse? Now you saw it. I and you know what I'm talking about. You agree. Hmm? You agree because you are there. You couldn't control the members of parliament. And of course, it, 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 it reached its climax when the president thought he can challenge a, 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 that young lady. That's what he thought he can challenge her. And he went to her. We have got ears, some of us, we hear. He went, and you know what the president said? Look at that. I, I want to, I want to be, I want to, 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 to narrate to you as you are seeing it.
You see? There is a president. Apadrinka Pata, she was shouting, my president, my Mufi. My president, my Mufi. So, H.H. works. You know? You can hear she's shouting there. Vakateko Mufi, are you here? Umufi. H.H. Eh? wants to go. Then he goes back. He goes back to her. Okay? Now the cameras change to show you from inside now. HH goes there. What if I lied? Is it me who has uh, brought drought? It's God who has brought a uh, uh, drought. And the girl goes, no! What we are talking about is you, leaving you, fuel. Eh? And that other MP said, no, no, please. Eh? At Wakule Cafe, the Mongo at Wakule Cafe, Kakule Cafe, and I come Kashan. And you are honorable, you are honorable, but Mumbe recalls him. There and the Febu no Guna Ban is the Sarah Mayan. Look, eh? I did our opposition. H didn't even waste time there. Eh? 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 She's shouting. Where are they? Eh, there she goes. He didn't have it easy. Then watch what's happening. Bakateko Ufi. Look at him. Huh? I mean, Bakateko Ufi. Ufi watch it more. He couldn't take it. He goes back in to confront her. He goes back in to confront her. Eh? What have I lied? Is it me who has brought drought? It's God. It's not me. I said, no. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about living me, fertilizer, fuel. Things are expensive. Eh? And then he goes, well, and then he says, eh, you see? Kaku Kanya eh? At Wakuleka. At Wakuleka. So, there you are. I'm telling you that woman is brave. And that bravery, that bravery is what you young people need. You can do it. This is your country. You should not be intimidated by these leaders. Don't be intimidated. Tell them the truth. Don't, 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 don't be naive to believe the, their lies. Don't. How many times will Baka and HM cheat about the same things? He's always cheating about it. Uh, about uh, uh, desks, hey, people are making desks, whatever, whatever. How many young people are struggling to sell those who are already paying for my desk? You you run with it like you have given the whole country. If you have given the whole country, why haven't we seen the economy appreciating? If it, if it is true, what we are kind actually of might say that a lot of young people and making desk by Zambia and with this money that is flowing in the community. Why is it that we can't see that money? Why is it that many young people are still languishing without jobs? Why is it that we are having many young people becoming junks, as you call them? Why is it that we have so many young people going into marriages? Why is it that we have so many young people becoming prostitutes? Why is it that we have so many young people becoming criminals? If indeed what we what you are saying by H H, this is what I'm challenging you with. I'm challenging you. If you are, if you are doing so well with your numbers that you say numbers don't lie, numbers don't lie. You mentioned ten, but you forget about it. Other one million, one other young one million uh, 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 young people. If out of 
one one hundred thousand. Like you, you know, like even this nonsense that you like to talk about, a hey, nurses, teachers, and whatever, whatever, because that is the only job that jobs that you have created, which are not jobs which you have created. Those are government jobs. Government jobs are not job creation. But okay, let's see, talk about that. Where you have 250, 250 applications, and you go and employ 30,000, and you start running, beating your chest, numbers don't lie. What kind of them? Think about it. You have 250,000 young people that have applied. You employ 30,000, and you have 220 left in the code. Is that something that you should beat yourself on the chest? So, you should think, whilst you're giving these numbers, think of how many that are left out. So, while you're busy beating about, hey, oh, hey, we, whatever, whatever, and look, Chitavichi Rufia, in five years, Chitavichi Rufia, he employed, I think about 40 to 50,000, in five years, 40 to 50,000, he employed. Imwe, in five years, are you going to employ 50,000? Are you going to employ 50,000? Because you are already more English, more English, 15,000. Only those that you have employed, you are not going to employ more. And even those, a number of them are still struggling. There is nothing to boast about. And young people, you need to start telling the president, when you see him, Getting excited, don't get excited to take pictures. Start shouting wherever you see what kind of HM. Shout in Salah. Shout to Rufi Wachiramo. Shout Kuyabebele. Start shouting, start telling him what kind of HM. Wherever you see him, Kuyabebele. Start telling him you have failed. Let him hear. Shout from wherever you are. She showed you the example. He will hear you, Moto Kaide Peter. Shout, Kuya Levere. Shout, you will start with fire. Don't even give him chance to come and lie to you. Start telling him now. Start telling him. Don't even allow Hakan Bechema to go to campaign in 2026. Don't allow him if he can even reach 2026. Otherwise, let's, let's transmit the message so that. Maybe he can have morality in himself and, and resign. Maybe he can resign if we start telling him. Start shouting from wherever you are. When you see her kind of HM, shout, shout, shout it. Tell him, tell him. You don't need a leader who is not helping you. Why? For what? You need a leader who is supposed to be helping you. Hakan HMI is not helping you. He's not helping our country. He's not. So why should we keep him? Let him go. Let him go. And it's us, the people, to make him go. It's us to tell him. Let's ask Hakan HMI to resign and go. Because he has failed. Congratulations once again to Jim Salah. She said, Galara, congratulations, honorable. You did a good job. Young people, you have a challenge. I know I made Muti when Parliament will resume. I wouldn't be surprised if they won't come up with whatever, whatever to suspend her. But there is nothing that there is nothing wrong that she did. Don't curtail her. Don't curtail her, don't suspend her for exercising her right. She has got the right to her opinion. I know Mke Manama objections. Hey, hey, point of order, point of order. If you have Kuba, she was right. And even those who are running who are running commentaries, they were right. Because the president was not delivering anything to even talk about. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.